Now let's talk about the major object command line. The major object command line calculates the property values of certain type of object. You can use major object to count object or count object with specified property and you can also use major object to calculate the minimum, maximum, sum, standard deviation and average of numeric values. For string objects, you can also use major object to count the number of line, words and characters. So let's see an example for this. Go to the PowerShell command prompt. And if you want to know the parameters of major object command led, then we can take help of get help command led. So type get help and mention major object, hit enter. And here we can see major object supports property parameter, input object parameter, sum parameter, average parameter and so on. Now let's try to measure the character words and line in a text file. So let's go to the desktop. Here we have a.txt and it has some text inside it. So let's try to measure that. So come to the PowerShell command prompt. First of all, let's get the content of the file here. So type get content to get the content of the file and mention the path. a.txt, the file name and hit enter. And here you can see content has been printed on the console. So let's get the number of characters in the file. And to do that, let's use the major object here. And to calculate the number of characters, we can take help of character parameter here. So type character and hit enter. And here it shows that it has 47 character in the text file. Okay. Now let's get the number of lines in the file. So here we can see we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it should return seven. So let's verify. And to count the number of lines, we will take help of line parameter here. Okay. So type line and hit enter. And here we can see seven has returned. And let's count the number of words in the file. So here we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's verify. And to count the number of words, we will take help of word parameter here. So if you see, we have the word parameter here. So let's use that and hit enter and eight words has been written. 